right now at noon. A safety alert today after the arrest of a Miami-Dade school employee. We've learned he's facing multiple molestation charges. Local 10 News reporter Trent Kelly is live outside the Bob Graham K-8 through Education Center in Miami Lakes. And that's where the suspect worked in the IT department, we understand. Uh, fill us in with more information. Yeah, that's right, Christy. From what we're told, this worker was employed strictly as an IT technician here at the school behind me and was only supposed to fix computers here. Despite that, 50-year-old Martin Zaretsky now stands accused of developing inappropriate relationships with students, relationships which detectives tell us clearly crossed the line. A Miami-Dade Schools employee now out of a job and sitting in jail after he's accused of molesting and seeking inappropriate relationships with students at the Bob Graham K-8 Education Center in Miami Lakes. Police arresting 50-year-old Martin Zaretsky on Monday on seven counts of molestation and another seven counts of committing offenses against a student. According to his arrest report, Zaretsky, who worked in the school's IT department, would, quote, intentionally touch the victim victims on their breast and buttocks areas over the clothing and against their will in a lewd manner. It says Zaretsky was caught communicating via text message with two of the victims on several occasions without parental consent, adding he would, quote, wait for the victims after school. He would walk them to his office and give them candy. He would then walk them back to the gate, hug them in a caressing manner and say goodbye. Investigators also say he made sexual remarks towards the victims telling them, quote, you look good today, you have a curvy body. He asked them their age and stated he was younger than their fathers. You should never be alone with only one adult. Parents at the school reacting to the allegations before details of Zaretsky's arrest were made public. I never know what could be going on with some people. If they are being checked, if they, oh, the kids are never alone in a specific area. This is Mr. Martin Zaretsky. So, sir, you were arrested for um, some serious charges molestation charge, seven count. Zaretsky appearing in bond court this morning where a detective detailed the charges and mentioned all the alleged victims were under the age of 16. His job was only to fix computers. He was not supposed to be walking kids out after a dismissal. He was not supposed to be going to the cafeteria and giving them food. And in a statement, officials with the Miami-Dade School Public School District tell us they were, quote, deeply disturbed by the troubling allegations and that as soon as they learned about this, they say police immediately began their investigation and subsequently made an arrest. They add this type of behavior will not be tolerated, and they mention that the district has now started the process of firing Zaretsky. Meantime, in court today, a judge did find probable cause for Zaretsky's arrest and ended up setting his bond at $70,000. If he is released from jail on bond, he must stay away from the school here. He must also have no contact with the alleged victims. For now, that is the latest live from Miami Lakes this afternoon. I'm Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.